Okay, so half guard break. There's a number of half guard breaks. Where this won't, we're going to call a baseball slide half break. So you can get to this in two ways. Getz is going to show both ways today. Look, first thing he does is he switches his hips. Even when Marcelo has his lights locked, he just switches his hips. Getz brings in his bottom knee close so he doesn't get swept. And now he walks his foot up. He wants to walk his foot up because he wants his knee pointing to the ceiling. It makes it a lot easier for him to take the knee off of him. He needs to have that knee free because we're going to rotate it in a second. Now what Getz does, he comes back around with his hand and he underhooks the arm to mark Marcelo here. This arm comes out, pushes the head, and puts his head on the mat. So he's all on one side of Marcelo here. Now watch what Getz does. He rotates his hip, he comes up on that. He rotates his hip, which brings his knee in. He puts all his weight on Marcelo right here, and he pulls up with the left arm, and he drags the knee through and sits out for side control. Okay, that's one way to get it out. The second way, same setup. He's here, look, watch. Come down here, RJ. Watch the foot position down here. He puts this foot in as a pry bar and he, sque he, he pops out the leg. So he's prying that, same setup. He's got the arm hooked, he puts the head to the side, he's got that pry bar. Look, he brings out the leg, slides it through, same setup, sits through for side control. Okay, so those are two corkscrew, uh, baseball slides, sorry, baseball slide passes.